amazing. 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 Asombrosos. Amazing could only describe the New York Mets. In 1969, baseball instituted divisional play and the championship series, and the Mets, once baseball's laughing stock, won the pennant. Tom Seaver and a young pitching staff led the way. The expansion Mets had never finished higher than ninth, but New York was in for a treat. The 69 series put the Mets against the Baltimore Orioles, touted by many as the strongest team since the 61 Yankees. Winning the National League pennant had been a triumph indeed, but beating the Orioles might take a miracle. But miracles were at hand, especially the gloved hands of Met fielders. With the series tied at a game apiece, Baltimore's Elrod Hendricks bats with two men on. Mets center fielder Tommy Agee comes to the rescue, saving at least two runs, maybe more. In the seventh, Paul Blair bats with the bases loaded against Nolan Ryan. Another shot deep in the gap, this time right center field. It's Agee's second incredible catch of the day, and this one saved at least three runs. Tommy Agee had prevented five runs, and the Mets won five to nothing. But game four would feature more. Ninth inning, ace Tom Seaver leads one to nothing as Brooks Robinson bats with one out and runners at first and third. Out of nowhere comes right fielder Ron Swoboda. The tying run scored on a most unusual sacrifice fly. A replay shows again how incredible this grab really was. Many consider it the best World Series catch ever. Clearly, the amazing Mets and Ron Swoboda could do no wrong. In the bottom of the 10th, the vaunted Oriole defense takes on characteristics of the Mets of old, as a bloop double puts the potential winning run on second. Pinch hitter J.C. Martin is ordered to bunt. Martin runs to first inside the baseline, and the throw hits him, a controversial play. The winning run scores, and the Mets now lead three games to one. All New York is caught up in the fairy tale. In game five, Jerry Kuzman gave up three early runs, but the Mets come back to take a five to three lead. And in the ninth, Kuzman needs only one last out. The amazing Mets are world champions. A miracle, perhaps but also the product of timely hitting, tight defense, and stingy pitching that held the Orioles to a 146 team batting average. A great win for the New York Mets and manager Gil Hodges. Little did we know back at that time that the man who made the final out of the 1969 World Series for the Orioles would later become a manager for the Mets in the 1980s. For all of us at ESPN, we hope you've enjoyed this presentation of baseball's greatest hits, the 19.